Okay, now we can talk. Lipsticks I would use for fall if I only let myself use certain colors for the season. So let's do it. So firstly, I have like a whole assortment here. So I have actually only one bullet lipstick I would actually use for fall, which would be Essence Semi Matte. It's in the shade Free. So here's that. The only bullet lipstick I would use for fall. And I have a fluffy pencil in the shade Dragon Girl because you gotta have a red lip. So that's Dragon Girl in shade, well, from Nards. So that's the only lippy pencil I have. And then the rest are liquid lipsticks. So, and some glosses. Ah. All right, so I have a couple from JSC in the shade Yummy. Look at that pretty orange. So that's the one I would keep because, you know, fall collars here. Keep fall in mind. We have special order. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's pretty fall, right? We have psychedelic witch. And I'm so olive toned that I have to wear a lip liner with this or it just kind of blends in. My lips can entirely disappear. Weird. As Nikki Raven says, we, we are a part of the orcs. It's olive toned skin girls. But I don't understand how that just gone. And we have the shade Dead Presidents. Because you gotta have that green in there, right? And then I have three from Sugar Pill. We have the shade shade zero because you have to have a black in there. That's a must because fall is in spooky season. Which is why we have our oranges. That's the shade zero. And then we have the shade dropout from them as well. Because you gotta have another green. Right? But that looks almost like this one, but it's got like sparkles. And then the other shade is Teacher's Pet. This is another orange, but it's, pretty, it's still sparkly. It's just deeper than that one. Okay, so now we're into three single liquid lippies from like a brand. And because it's fall, you have to have a brown. So we have the Jaclyn Hill liquid lippy. Pout Spoken, so it's the, I think it's the brand. Anyway, it's in the shade Feisty. So there's our one brown <laughs> for fall. And I have another red. It's the Rare Beauty. It's in the shade Inspire. That's that one. It's kind of like a red orange. That's why that one's in there. And then we have one more red. I lied. It's a metallic red. It's from Smashbox and it's called Vino Noir. It's my favorite metallic red. Right there, kind of like a maroon, like a wine maroon. And then we're into lip glosses. I have four lip glosses I would have just for fall. So we have the shade Mim Mim Mimoplasm. And they're from Sparkly's Lip Gloss, Sparkly's Glitter and Gloss. So here's my Plasm. Go ahead and swatch it. We're gonna get a hand space. There is that is my Plasm. Beautiful shift. And these last a while. Oh no, I've got. It's everywhere. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I got one of the red stuff on me. I oh, one of the red lippies. Okay, we got it fixed. Problem solved. 
And then the next one is Angelic Cores. This isn't even fall related, but I would have to have this in fall to go over like one of the matte shades. Give it some oomph. So there's in. There's. Ah, uh, this is horrible. So there's Angelic Cores. Then we have Inferno to go with our reds. That is the shade Inferno. And then the last gloss I would have is Volcanic Fallout. So this one is Volcanic Fallout. So that's the shades I would have for my fall selection. You know, I did the fall not bleh, the fall video for palettes, so now we did lippies. Alright, so what kind of fall lipsticks would you have? What would be your colors three? I'm all over the place as normal, so you know, this kind of suits. Let me know what you would do for fall for just lipsticks. If you stuck yourself in just that era of fall aesthetic, what I have to use for fall makeup category, you know what I mean? All right, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.